Hello guys and girls, I welcome you all to Open Index for you. Today we will learn how to install Unity in your PC from scratch. It will be a completely guidelines to how can you install and what are the requirement and why should you use Unity instead of other engines. Uh, we will talk everything in here. Okay, so this is the Unity's official website, or you can also go for you know like just typing Unity.com and just go for it. Yeah, this is it. The same one. Uh, here you can see the start beginning of the, the official website. You can read everything in here. Okay. If you have spare time, then then just come here and watch for yourself. What's written on the terms and condition and etc. What are features you're going to look for? Everything will be here. Okay. So if you are here, so you that means you want to build a game or you are interesting to building a game. Okay. So there are some uh, uh, some field to making games. There are some few engines like Epic Games, like Unreal Engine, um, Unity, Godot. Those are uh, Cry Engine. Those are all uh, very popular game engines. But I would recommend you to go for Unity if you have a small team and a small budget, or you alone want to make a game. Then please go for Unity, cause Epic Games can be very expensive sometimes. Epic Games, uh, at first, you know, don't going to ask for in royalty from you, but later it will uh, it will cost for five percent uh, royalty charge from you, which will be uh, not in a small case, but in a larger scale, it will be a, a lot of you know going to be a lot very expensive. So just skip for it, and let's go for Unity installing process. Okay, click on get started. Here you can see there are some uh, wait wait don't scared. You don't have to pay for anything. These are play pro uh, plus or enterprise uh, section. Okay, you have to pay for all the getting all these features. We don't want it. We just want the free version. Okay, so go for the individual section and you will find a student version and a personal version. Okay, student version I don't gonna recommend for it because the everything you get in student version you will get in personal version as well, except some of these just. Go for it, just this one or something. This you can read it, okay? Just list the version of Unity Core. You will go out in here and here as well. The five seats of Unity Team advanced, advanced. You cannot, cannot get in here, but you will get the resource of getting started and learning Unity. You are getting some resources, really good, good resource in personal, okay? And real time cloud. Oh, you don't need it, you have to pay for it if you want in person, okay? So, here is only one eligibility in personal which is the revenue of funding less than 100,000 in the last 12 months, 100,000 uh, $100, dollar, okay, which is uh, a lot actually, if you want to make this within a year, then you are a great, and then you can go for you know, the, uh, the those plans like, you know, here, those plans or pro, okay, and the only downside in uh, personal thing is, um the personal package is that there should be a splash screen with uh, logo written unity uh, every time you launch your game so this could be annoying sometimes but yeah we can bear with it don't no problem it's just sometimes reading. okay so yeah just click on get started and it will direct you to the page here you will ask for first if you are a first time user or a returning user of course i guess you are a returning user or a first time so this one is perfect for you guys first time okay there are some terms and condition you have you can read all of these the, it's very simple go for it they have as i said before you have not raised funds in excesses of one hundred thousand dollar per year okay annually or not currently using unity plus or pro plans if you using unity plus or pro plans please keep it and go for unity plus and download from there okay if you are using free then just follow along with me just hit on create and it will start it downloading instantly okay i'm going to skip it because i don't need it i've already downloaded it okay you will most probably find it in here so in folder and your one it should be here and just double click on it and install it okay it's very simple then please open unity hub here this is uh, now i will tell you why you should use Unity hub okay as you can see this is unity hub opening for it uh, this version is currently 2.4.1 okay and there is four section one each project 
learn community and install okay i'll guide you through everything okay here's the project section if you are installing new then there should be no project in your uh, henry hub it will be totally blank you can create from new from here i'll tell you later about it there's a learn section i as i talked before the resources like uh, the learning resources the tutorials the projects it's the uh, the learning method some projects you can load in your unity building machine and then just uh, look for reference and how how it build it and how it's all works something like that then go for your own project okay there are some tutorial good to very good tutorial like unity made by unity uh, these are all approved tutorials some of them you will also find a lot in youtube videos okay there's some community section where you will find all the community officially launched by unity and here's the more important part this is installing but before that please uh, go for unity in here and you will see the unity logo in here okay there's unity id you have to create an id to you know to log in in unity hub okay so create an if you have an id then please uh, just skip this part and uh, go for unity hub and then uh, just log in in here okay if you don't have an id then go and create a unity id first just wait a few seconds let's see here you can you know put your email id here make a new password for it a username and a full name please don't use your email id password okay and fill the captcha and create a unity id it's as simple as it is okay and then come here and log in your id first then go for settings and here is a license uh, management you have to you know um, you need to activate a license for it sorry as per general there is a uh, path to install unity for you my path is local type c programming file and here is called unity what is it, what is it? Uh, this is it unity or unity hub what do i have i have already created unity and you can just skip on it just place select folder and boom this is it okay and then click on save and uh, the language in here is english and some of our different i do not understand what it says but yeah i will go for english uh, license management here you have to activate a new license okay uh, there are two licenses in the plus or pro if you don't have a plus or pro then just click on it and click on i the company or organization i represent earned less than 100k gross revenue of we can read all of this okay then click on done then your license will be renewed asap just wait a few seconds a license is successfully activated as you can see it's activated so this is advanced section where it just says uh, release channel if you're using a beta channel if you're using a beta channel then the contents new features before they are released in production channel new releases will be downloaded automatically and installed you need to have is restarted etc 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 i'll go for production i'm going to recommend it for you it uh, as it says it's stable so now come to installing part and hit add if you don't have one then add there's a uh, some of those you know some the versions of unity 2019.4 lts version uh, or one second lts means long term support this is uh, one of the unity's official and uh, the recommended version okay and there's the official version as well 2020 and all of the version if you don't one point extra point uh, if you one cannot find what kind of person you are looking for then please go for download achieve in your website okay just a second go my internet is very slow i guess just wait for it here as you can see all of the features you'll find it in here okay 2019 2018 17 in the five in the four in the three all of the features you will get in here okay also if i did so quite sometimes and then just hit on you know in the hub yeah this is it okay and it will redirect you to unity hub whatever and once you do then click on next there's a module section and i will tell you that if you are going to uh, use c sharp language to create games in unity then you have to install microsoft visual studio community it's recommended okay if you have another then it's fine i guess but it you have to install unity so studio so, uh, sorry visual studio community 2019 and 
here is some platform section the blood uh, build support for it what kind of um, uh, i mean what which platform you going to choose if i i'm going to use for you know android devices for mobile devices so you can use android just click on it okay and check for it that there is android sdk and ndk tool are clicked okay and iso then click on iso tv os linux max universal webgl you can choose any of them okay there's a documentation if you want to read documents then click on it if not then please skip it okay there's some language preference if you just do need then click on and then click next okay i don't want iso it's just for android okay then he clicked on next here you will see a pop-up bar about uh, visual studio terms and conditions then yeah next click and rest again indicate tools so blah, blah, blah. you can read all of them or it's just skip and yeah i agree to terms and conditions then hit okay and it will automatically start yeah but i have already downloaded and installed a lot of them so i don't going to skip that part and then if you are going to successfully installed uh, your version of unity then go to project section and here click uh, if you have already already created a previous um, project then go to add and find that folder where is it and then if you this one then just click select folder and it will be you know listed here here it is but uh, let it go if you are going to create a new project then click on new but uh, instead of clicking on new i recommend you to go for drop down menu and select your version which version you would like to create a new project then click on it and choose your template if you're going to make a 2d game then click on 2d uh, 3d game for 3d 3 to the extra will uh, create a 3d project with some extra objects in it uh, skip that part i don't recommend for this one uh, this is high definition rp if you want to make your game like a triple a game or uh, a game with uh, high level visuals then go for it this one and if you want to make a uh, low level uh, i mean standard level visual graphics for your android mobile and uh, different different uh, platforms then please go for universal Air pipeline this one is mostly used uh, uh, templates of them all and these are inbuilt but uh, if you want to make a basic 3d game then click on this one and make a project name like i'm gonna do you know um jumping ball it's a random name you can select uh, anything like that i mean sorry uh, like that and if yeah, you have to choose a uh, location if i would like to you know uh, install your project uh, just click i'm going to just simple it uh, for desktop okay and then hit create and it will create your project in no time you need to take some times to make projects so i'll going to skip that part okay <laughs> Here. it will create a new it will take some time so yeah this is it guys uh please subscribe to my channel it's new channel and uh, tell me what kind of video you want to see next i will um uh, make videos like you know blender if you guys want to then create 2d art for ui and ux design and uh, music production if you want to make your music um, for your games then yeah, I will make this part as well. Uh, so this is it guys. See you in the next video. Thank you.